Hi guys, I'm Isaac. Hi, I'm Maddie. And we're gonna give you a tour of North. Uh, first up, we have the main office. And in the main office, you can get your schedule. You come in if you're late to check in and to sign out, you go in the main office too. Okay, next up we have the arts wing, the 900s. So far uh, in my three years of high school, I've taken uh, photography and painting, and I've taken photography with Mrs. Murphy, and I absolutely loved it. First up, we have painting. Um, I took this class as a freshman, and next we have jewelry. So I guess we made jewelry here and necklaces and earrings, looks like. And then we got ceramics and pottery. Mm -hmm. And we have some on display over here as well from students. Okay, so we just left the 900s and now we're in the commons, um, which leads to the gymnasium. And around the corner we have the band hallway and then the cafeteria over here. This is the commons. Occasionally special things happen here. Like um, every morning people get off from their bus and socialize and talk, just like the fishbowl. There's a lot of fairs set up here sometimes, uh, as, long, as well as with the gym. And now we're gonna go to the music hallway. Um, this is the music hallway. Uh, orchestra and band are in this hallway. Um, you can see this is the orchestra classroom, 923. And both the orchestra and the band put on multiple concerts throughout the year, as well as sometimes playing in uh, special events like basketball games and sometimes during Christmas they're out in the commons playing for everyone. So that's nice. This is the band room. It's a pretty big room. Um, we're going to go back to the commons now and show you where the main pickup and drop off is for the buses. Um, so here's where you go out to the sidewalk every day um, to get picked up by the bus as well as being dropped off. Um, so when you leave school by bus is where you go and you're released by waves every day. And when you start driving, you can park in lower lot, which is the big lot by the uh, tennis courts. Um, so we're leaving the commons now and we're gonna go on to the cafeteria. Okay, so we're coming into the cafeteria right now. In the cafeteria, there are multiple lines to get food. There's typically in between four to five. Most lines offer different meals. Okay, so we're leaving the commons now and here we have the choir room and the theater room. So something cool about choir is um, around Valentine's Day, they start selling these things called singing Valentines. And so if you ever want to embarrass your friends or anything like that, you can buy one and they come to their classroom and sing for them. So that's pretty fun. Absolutely. You can also buy multiple. And here's the theater room. They put on shows um, which you can go watch. So if you have friends in theater or your family's there to support, they can do that for sure. Okay, so just the reorientation, we have the atrium here and we're leaving going towards the academic wing. And a hint for all you guys coming in, um, here we have a flag and based on which day it is, so we have gold days and maroon days, um, it changes colors based on which day it is. So right now it's a maroon day and um, when it's a gold day, it's a gold flag. So if you ever forget, just check the flag. Um, so we have the attendance room, so you need to stop by there if you're leaving early from school to sign out. This is the guidance office. Before we go into the academic wing, let me show you the bookstore and the nurse's office. This, the bookstore is where you can get a bunch of your cougar gear along with pencils and paper. 
the nurse's office. You know, if you ever feel bad or uh, sick, just come here. Okay, so now we're entering the academic wing. And on my right here, we have the library, which houses a collection of thousands of books of every kind. And on my left is the LGI room, which typically houses a bunch of meetings for the clubs at our school. Before we go down to the academic wing, uh, we are going to pause and take a selfie at the selfie wall. Uh, we're making our way down to the academic hall, uh, to the 200s to math, but on our left up here is CRAM. And that's where you take your computer uh, if it's broken or you need help with technological stuff. On our left right here is the 200s, the math wing. So we're in the 200s now, um, the math wing. The classes range from Algebra 1 all the way up to Calculus, and after that, you can even go to IU if you want to take higher math classes. I personally am not that skilled in math, but if you are, that's certainly an option. We're about to head into uh, Mr. Bullman's room. If you are a freshman, you'll probably be in Algebra 1 to Geometry, but Mr. Bullman's room is right here on the right. We're leaving the 200s now, and we're going to go on to the 300s. So now we're at the 300s. Um, this is where business classes and some photography classes are, as well as some study halls. Okay, so we're leaving the 300s now and we're gonna move on to the 400s, which is where all the languages are. In the 400s here we have classes like Spanish, Latin, French, Chinese, Japanese, and German, and clubs for all of them as well as ASL. We're leaving the 400s hallway, and now we're getting ready to make our way to the 500s to social studies. This swing, the 500s, is mainly used for history and health, but it also houses uh, the main room for internship classes. Your freshman year, you'll probably take geography and history, so you may have Mr. Adams. Let's see what he's up to. Bothering my students? Yeah. yeah. Stuff here. Would you like to be in, um... No. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I am famous. I don't want to be more famous. Not even... You don't want to show off your plunger? I don't want to show off anything. Okay. <laughs> now we're leaving the 500s and we're going on to the 600s, the English one. Okay, so we're now entering the 600s. Uh, this is the English wing. You will be here for all four years of high school. Um, you'll typically like freshman year English. Uh, it's a lot of work, but you do learn a lot and the topics are enjoyable. Okay, we're coming out of the 600s right now and we're going our way to the nearest stairwell and we're going downstairs to science. Um, so down here is not only science, but there's also athletic classrooms as well as consumer science. As a freshman, um, you're most likely going to take biology, which is one of my favorite classes as a freshman. And part of it, you even get to see real life animals they bring to the classroom, which I thought was really cool. We've gone to the end of the science wing, and now we're gonna head back to the athletic department, but before that, we just want to mention that we share campus with Hoosier Hills, which is a very helpful place to go sometimes if you're looking to um, study a little bit more on what you like. We're entering the athletic department right now. Uh, to the my left is room 18, which uh, is used for film and hospitality for our players and to our straight on and to our right is the weight room. We're leaving the indoor track and right here on my right 
is our athletic trainer, which is where um, athletes go if they're injured or they need physical therapy. And I think we're very lucky to have this and they're an amazing staff. So don't be shy to go there when you need help. So now we're gonna head back upstairs to the commons, which is connected to the gym. We just came back from downstairs and we're in the gym going back to the commons. Thank you for joining us on this tour. It's great to be a cougar.